Hey everybody, welcome to the next workout in this series. So we're going to do a 20 minute body weight workout. Um, high intensity, today we're gonna to focus a little bit more on lower body legs um, and then some high intensity moves, get your heart rate up and try and get people into incredible shape for November, a notoriously hard month for staying motivated. I know myself, it's the hardest month of the year. Um, so these workouts are just as much for me as anybody else watching. So thanks for joining in. Um, if you haven't commented or tagged your friends below, um, if you're watching this on Facebook, please do that as well. And um, I'll be checking out YouTube comments too. So how these workouts work effectively today is we're gonna do 10 moves back to back, a minute on each move. We're gonna go all out, whatever your level is, you're gonna go do your 10 out of 10. You can keep to my pace, or you can work to your own pace and take a break as often as you need to. So we're gonna do 10 moves back to back to back to back to back, minute on each one with little breaks in between, and then we're gonna do a four minute finisher all together. So about 20 minutes total, we'll get rocking and rolling. Welcome to section workout two. So first move is gonna be lower body. We're gonna start with reverse lunges. So you're starting a shoulder back core type move, stepping back, weight through your heels on your non-lunge foot, and we're gonna reverse and alternate on each leg for the move. 60 seconds. Three, two, one. So reverse lunging. Use your arm and elbow for coordination if you need to. Some people will do with hands by the side. If that's more comfortable for you, you can do it that way. I use elbows for coordination because it's not the best. Stepping through your heel, so putting all the weight to the back of your foot, or front of your foot through your heel. You should be able to wiggle your toes at the bottom and at the top of the move. That's how you know you're loading correctly, getting some blood into our legs on the first move. That's it, 30 seconds. Good job, everyone. That's it, and be sure, if you find this workout good, be sure to comment below after and let me know how it goes. And be sure to check YouTube for the last few if you need extra motivation or extra workouts for the month of November. 15 seconds, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and relax. Okay, straight into the next move. We're gonna go squats, squatting narrow, jumping out wide, back to narrow, jumping out wide. 60 seconds, 3, 2, one, narrow, wide, that's it, 60 seconds. Again, weight through your heels. If you can't jump for whatever reason, just step out wide, step back in narrow, and if you wanna make it a little bit harder, do a jump on each one. Working through your quads, working through your hamstrings, all through your lower body, that's it. Good job, everyone, keep it going. We're gonna start with legs, and then we'll start working it up. 30 seconds. Narrow to wide, narrow to wide. Shake them out as you need to. 20 seconds. That's it, keep it going. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and relax. Take a breather. If, you need, if you've got water, grab some water. Stay hydrated throughout as you need to. Okay, the next move, we're going wall sits. So 90 degree angle against the wall, or if you don't have a wall, you can drop into the bottom of the squat. We're gonna hold for 60 seconds. Three, two, one, hold. 60 seconds. And remember, go at your own pace. You don't have to stick to my pace. Go as hard as you can. Your nine out of 10, your 10 out of 10. And then take a breather anytime you need to. It's all about working at your own pace. Hit workouts are great. Burn more calories, tear more fibers down so you burn more calories while you rest. Oh, great way to start your day. Great way to end your day. Or just work, put at the end of your normal workouts. 30 seconds. That's it. Burn right through the quads. Oh, keep it held, well done everyone. Bring it up as you need to. And then dropping in. 20 seconds, 90 degrees, keep it held. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh, how relax. Okay, shake out your legs. Take a breather if you've got water, take a drink. 
Next move, we're going high knees. So coming straight up, high knees. Bring it up as high as you can. Shoulders back, core tight. Three, two, one, and high knees. That's it. Bring your knees right up. Hands where they're comfortable. Some people find this better for coordination. I like to hold mine up like this, but whatever is the most comfortable for you. Getting your heart rate up, high knees. Good job, everyone. Keep it going. Shake out your legs as you need to, and then back in. High knees, shoulders back, 30 seconds. Keep it going. Doing amazing, everyone. 10 moves total. 20 seconds. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh, and relax. Take a breather. If you have a towel, grab a towel. I forgot mine. Your water. And grab some water. Okay, next move, we're going to the ground. We're going to do a variation of a burpee. So we're standing with our legs together. We're coming up wide, so up to your hands, and then standing up straight at the top. Okay, 60 seconds. Three, two, one. Legs together, coming up wide, and straight up at the top. Together, up wide, shoulders back, and squeezing through your glutes. If you're trying to get a bigger bone, and that's your focus, squeeze through your glutes at the top of each move. Otherwise, pull your shoulders back. That's it, coming up wide. Try and get your hands up or your feet up to where your hands are. 30 seconds. Good job, everyone. These are called wide burpee, no jump, or whatever name you want to put on them. That's what I call them. 15 seconds, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and relax. Whew. Okay, stay in that position. Next move, it's going to be on the floor again. Okay, following on from burpees, we're going flat on the floor, water out a shot. We're gonna go straight ahead, and then we're gonna go up into a burpee with a slight jump at the top. So dead, cutting out all the momentum at the bottom, coming up into a jump. Three, two, one, starting positions, hands out, and then getting your body up into the air. Slight jump, you can go as high as you want, hands straight, and then coming up into a jump. That's it, hands out straight, Kill all the momentum, makes it way harder. And again, go at your own pace. You can stick to me, but it's about doing your 10 out of 10, as hard as you can go. 30 seconds, that's it. That's it, keep it going. Burpees are a killer, they never get any easier. 15 seconds, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and relax. Four. Take a breather. Oh. Catch your breath. You're doing amazing, everyone. Oh. Okay, a couple more to go. Oh. All right, next move. We're going plank position. So, our push up position. And then we're gonna kick back. Try and keep your leg as straight as possible. And we're gonna kick back through our glutes. Great move for our core, great move for your glutes. So if you're an athlete trying to get faster, or a girl trying to build your bum, or just trying to get a six pack or flatten your stomach, great move. 60 seconds. Three, two, one. Push up position. Legs straight. Mine tend to bend as I fatigue, but try and keep them as straight as possible. That's it. You can straight back, up to your glutes. Keeping your core tight, keeping your upper body strong, and then kicking back through your glutes. 
oh, and take a breather, drop to your knees, and then back in as you need to, 30 seconds. Oh, push up position, kicking them back. Oh, 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 20 seconds, just over. Oh, 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 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh, oh. Take a breather. Catch your breath. Next move, we're going to stay in that position. We're going to go straight ahead for mountain climbers. Home stretch, last few moves. So, we're going to push up position and we're going to go mountain climbers straight ahead. Keeping your core tight throughout. 60 seconds. Three, two, one, and straight ahead. That's it. Slow and controlled. You can speed it up and it gets your heart rate a little bit higher. This is a little bit more contraction through your abs. Oh, flatten out your stomach, help your six pack. Oh, drop as you need to. Keep more contraction oh, on the muscles through your core. Oh, 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 30 seconds. Drop to your knees as need to. That's it, keep it going. Finish it strong. Oh, 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 20 seconds. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh, how relaxed. Oh, catch your breath. Oh, sweating. Oh, it's hard. Okay, two more moves. And then we're going to take a break. And then we've got our finisher. And then we're done. Okay, let's move. We're starting on the floor. We're gonna come up, step up, step back down onto our knees, and then back up. Stay in a squat position throughout. If you have a mat or a carpet, use that. I forgot my mat today, but just takes a little bit of tension off your knees from the ground. Okay, step ups, 60 seconds, two moves left. Three, two, one, starting position on the floor. Coming up into a squat and then back down. Oh, that's it. Try and keep the squat. Back to your knees and back up. Oh, that's it. Keep it going. Nearly there. Two moves left. Then we'll take a breather. Then we'll do our finisher and then we're all done. Oh, that's it. Hands where they're comfortable. Shoulders back. It's core tight. Oh, 30 seconds. Oh, shake out your legs as you need to and then back in. Oh, 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 keep it going. Nearly there. 20 seconds. Oh, oh. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh, all right. Come on. One more left. Then we take a breather. And then we've got a finisher. Core. And then we're done. Okay, last move. We're going normal squats with a slightly wider stance. So dropping in, wide stance, normal squat. 60 seconds. Three, two, one. That's it. 60 seconds. Normal squat with a slightly wider stance. Shoulders back, core tight, weight through your heels. Should be able to wiggle your toes at the top. Should be able to wiggle your toes at the bottom. That's how you know you're loading in the right place. Hands wherever they're comfortable. Some people in front, some like it down by the side. I like it in front. Or right, then switching. So whatever's the most comfortable for you or feels the most natural for you. 30 seconds. Keep it going. Last move. Then we'll take a breather. I'll talk you through the finisher and then we're done. 20 seconds. Last move. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh, and relax. Okay, last move. Okay, two minute rest. Last move is going to be a four minute Tabata. So we're going to do 20 seconds on, 
10 seconds off, eight rounds for a total of four minutes. And then we're done. 20 minutes is up, killer workout to start your day, end your day, or break up your day. However you're doing it and whenever you're doing it. Be sure after this comment, let me know what you think. Even if it's just uh, that was a killer, that was too easy, or whatever it is, depending on your level or how you found it. I found it a killer. Okay, last move. We're going to a plank position and we're going to do dragon lifts. We're bringing our knees up. We're going to go 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off, four minutes total. And then we're done. Okay, I'm going to put my watch in front. If you've got your watch, you can keep it in front of you or you can work off my time whenever it's easier. Three, two, one. Okay, plank position, knees up. If you have a mat, use your mat or a pillow, whatever you need for your elbows. Oh, that's it, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. Oh, that's it, five, four, three, two, one, 10 second rest. That's it, eight rounds total. This gets real after two, three rounds. That's it, five, four, three, two, one, back in. That's it, bring your legs up. That's it, knees to elbows. Oh, that's it. Good job, everyone. Nearly there, 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh, and relax. 10 seconds. Catch your breath. Get the air out of your stomach. Nearly there. Six rounds, and we're done. Three, two, one, back up. Oh. If for whatever reason you can't do this and bring your knees up, just hold a plank. Oh, 10 seconds. Hold your plank if you have to. Even if you can't bring your legs up, just hold a plank. Three, two, one. Oh, and drop it down. 10 second rest. Oh, catch your breath. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Back into a plank. Bring your legs up or hold that plank. We're nearly there. We're coming up to the halfway point. We're done after this. Oh, 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 10 seconds. Oh, 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 three, two, one. Oh, halfway. Four rounds to go. Two minutes and we're done. Nearly there. Oh, three, two, one. Back it. Hold the plank, even if you can't, I'm struggling now. Just hold the plank. Five, four, three, two, one, drop it down. Three to go, three rounds. Home stretch. Three, two, one, back up. Bring your knees up if you can, or hold your plank. Ugh. Okay, hold your plank. Ugh. That's me toast. Keep it going, 10 seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh, relax. Two to go, minute left. Minute left and we're done. Three, two, one, hold. Oh, plank hold, 20 seconds. Oh, oh. The second last one. Finish it strong, we're done after this. Oh, oh, oh. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh, and relax, one more. Last one. Oh, catch your breath. One more to go. Three, two, one, up. 20 seconds, hold it. It's the last one. Finish it strong. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And relax. Oh, oh. And take a breather. Oh, pull this way. Finishers the killer. Okay, that's workout two done. Oh, 
brutal one. So the beauty of these is you're, you're going to strip body fat two ways. You're getting your heart rate up, which is going to help you burn more calories in the workout. And you're tearing fibers down with all the resistance you're doing. So you're going to burn more calories while you rest as you try and repair from those workouts, those fibers that you've torn down. So it's a great way to ramp up your metabolism. So hopefully these workouts are helping for November. And just, oh, I know they kill me. So if you haven't checked out number one, go back and check that out. Next one's coming Monday at 7 a.m. So be sure to join me on Facebook or YouTube, 7 a.m. Check it out. Please tag your friends down below if they need a workout or comment and let me know how you found it. Thanks for watching. See you all next Monday, 7 a.m.